Greetings, Java viewers, and welcome to another Minecraft Modding for Beginners tutorial. Um, this is the tutorial after updating our mod to 1.6.4, and let's just get right into um, fixing some errors, right? So, um, first of all, you want to open up your perspective in Java instead of Java EE. And next up, go to Window, Short View, and choose the Package Explorer, and you can close down your Project Explorer. Alright, now go into your SRC and um, scroll down. The first thing we're going to be fixing is the modium sort. Now, there you might um, have some other errors in your mods, but we're going to be covering them up later on. So, first of all, this method is the multimap. Alright, I guess this makes sense. Um, the function might have changed name. I think they um, changed something about the sort. So, what we want to do, we want to scroll up and um, I'm just going to open up item sort. Like that. Just remove that sort thing. Alright, um, let's have a look at multi map. Um, multi map, multi map, multi map. Here. Alright, so what you want to do is you want to copy. Right, so now it's called get item attribute modifiers. I think all we can do actually, uh, very easy, is just to copy that and change this with that. And the field key is the attack damage. No, it's this one. And. Oh, alright, so. That, and this is. Attack damage. And that's how you fix that error. The weapon will now work again. There's no errors in the item modium sword. Let's move on to the entity. Alright. So something's wrong with our entity. Oh yeah, um, figures. So they added a new thing with the entity. Um, first of all, what I'm gonna do actually for the entity uh, mob things is to add this entity mob instead of animal, and um, open up this and look for this method called what is it? It's some new method they added. Um, something with attributes where you can put. Uh, there it is. I think it's this one. I'm not sure. Um, just remove this. And uh, remove that. You can do this. Dot. Get. Attribute. Map. Dot. Function something B and then the thingy camera attributes dot max health can we do equal ten? Yeah, I'm just gonna look for this thing. Alright, so it already has the max health. Um, right here. Um, you know, let's go and put on the movement speed as well. Um, it's called movement speed. So you can do. Oops, um, copy this. And instead of max health, put movement speed. Um, there we go. And uh, that is pretty much it. Now you have your mob entity file done. Close that down. Another render file. What's up with the render file? Oh yeah, okay, okay. So scroll down to the bottom. Uh, remove the override annotation. Um, add unimplemented methods. Protected resource location. Get entity. Oh, okay. Um, basically, what you want to do is um, copy this line. Um, your previous resource location. They just changed the name. 
what you can actually do is you can just change this function thing to um, that and then remove this actually you can add the overwrite um, quotation again and that's kind of it um, so all we already did was to change the function name to get entity texture and that's all you gotta do in your render file now I think that's it let's go ahead and run it and see if it works hmm it seems like um, whenever I try to spawn in the mod it skips the entity and what it also does um, well, that it just skips the entity and the sword is not have dealing any damage and um, well the same damage as a stake and a purple die whatever right um, we need to fix the damage and we need to fix the entity um, so first of all um, we're gonna fix the sword so go to your sword class and where do we have our damage mm. This the tool material like all right. Um, open up item sword again. Um, they might have changed the method for the damage it deals. And let's see what is now. Mm, um. Let's just copy this for now. I don't know if I misdid something. No, it doesn't look like that. Um, on left click entity. Oh yeah, yeah. no way about that. Um. You, I think that's it, man. There's not really that much to it. Um, this part two, yeah, yeah, yeah. Part two tool material. So we don't have that in there. Then again, all right. Um. It may be working now. Let's go ahead. And... All right, here it works again. Um, the sword um, works again with a damage of seven. So that's all good. Um, the mob didn't didn't work, so we're gonna fix the mob. Now to fix the mob, um, I actually have no idea how we fix the mob. So we're just gonna be testing a bit. Um, and you're gonna probably see me fail a couple of times. Um, first of all, I want to try change this back to animal. Not that it matters at all. Just so you guys know. And then we're going to add this. Not that it matters at all again. And we're going to be looking at um, some random entity. Uh -huh. Um, passive and uh, well, cow. Uh, let's see. Yes, get this instead. Um, your attributes. And what you want to do basically is um. Also, yeah, this is the line of code that um makes you able to put your own life. So we're, we're gonna put this to 20. Uh, no, this is a little fella. A little fella, let's put this 7.5. And Carl did 10, so it's a difference. And this is the moment speed. Um, it's kind of a weird number. Um, it's in decimals. It's in decimals, but don't play around this. Um, unless you want it quicker. Just change the number, or if you want to go in high depth, just change the other numbers. Um, I think we don't need anything more, but there might be something that um, fixes it. Uh, let's copy these. Oh, wait. 
いやいや。That's not supposed to be that everyone knows that. I'm not. That. 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 Alright, let's go and run this. No, wait, 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 um, before we do that, we'll have a look at the render file. Uh, do we have our mod? We have a mod. Let's go and check if it works. The moment of truth is about to arrive. That's the sound I gave it. Oh. And that's the third sound. Um, yeah, it, it, it works. <laughs> wow, that was loud like hell. Um, Alright, sound working, mod working, and texture working, render works, and entity. Alright, everything works. We have fixed our mod. And in the next video, we're going to be looking at how to actually publish a mod on the internet um, so that people can easily download it by just dragging a zip file into their mods folder. So, see you guys in the next video. Have a good night or day. And I'm out. Yes, it is. Oh.